Good morning guys, happy fitness week six. Um, so today is weigh in day. Uh, I'm very nervous, but um, yeah, excited to see what the scales say today. I've told Noah um, it's weigh in day and he wants to go on the scales. You gonna go on the scales, Noah? Okay. On your heart, let's have a look. Oh, 15.3 with monkey. Should monkey go on? Monkey weighs nothing. <laughs> okay, so last week I weighed in at 111 kilos. Um, so let's see. So I'm going to put the camera down. So put my phone down. 111. And then on. Okay, so the scales are on. Now it's telling me, step on the scale. Okay, so 110.7, 110.7. Good morning, guys. Hi. Hey. Say hi. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi, guys. Um, so, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are checking in with a Fitness Week uh, 6 video. Um, so we've just finished week five. I've just weighed in. I am down on the scales just a teeny bit, like 300 grams, so not even half a kilo. Um, but I will take it because I have really mixed feelings about this week. Um, so my promise to myself was to work out like as much as I could this week. And I think I did, I worked out every day but one day. Um, so... And that was a mixture of different exercises. I was doing some at home, HIIT workouts, high intensity interval training. Uh, I was doing some cardio in the gym at work. Um, so it was sort of a mixture of those two things. Um, so I felt really good about exercise and um, the day I didn't do it, I felt really bad. Um, because I've been enjoying gain up and just doing some sort of movement um, and some sort of exercise. I'm not doing it for long periods of time and like I'm only struggling while I'm doing it. Afterwards I'm fine and yeah I've been noticing a difference of um, wanting to work out whereas before I didn't really like it was sort of like oh do I have to work out. So I've kind of been enjoying gain up and um, working out. Um, but my food this week hasn't been the greatest. It started off really well early in the week. Like breakfast is fine. Lunches were fine. Um, but yeah, just over, I've had a couple of things on and work has been absolutely crazy. I actually, um, yeah, like had to stay at work the other night cause I worked, um, really late at night and then started the next morning. So there wasn't, um, yeah, I had to stay at work cause there was enough time to get there and back in between shifts. Um, so I sort of, um, was going okay with dinners and then, yeah, like I had, a, a lunch out with my girlfriend, um, and I'll insert a picture of the pancakes I had. They were kind of semi-healthy pancakes. They weren't terribly bad, um, but it still was a treat. Um, and then, yeah, just some little things like, um, with Noah this week and not being organized, um, so yeah, this week I have the whole week off work, so I'm really looking forward to improving my food situation and just getting some meal prep done. So I'm prepared. I just, when I am under, like not prepared and running out of time with a toddler and it's just like, okay, let's just grab something. Um, but in saying that, um, we had a day where we just wanted to go and have like fish and chips in the park. Um, and so we did that and... I felt so bad, like I felt so guilty, um, like I was just ruining all the work I'd done. So although like it was bad to have it, I think it was good just to, like it wasn't like I was like, oh my god, thank god I get like bad food or like, you know, I get chips or something like that. I felt so guilty. Um, but I've definitely noticed little changes, just like, I'm like coke free for over a month now. Um, it's so good, I feel great about it, I'm drinking a lot more water. Um, smoothies and yeah I'm just not even really noticing it now that I don't have it um, also another big change is late night snacking um, me and my partner sort of used to sit down and grab some chips or chocolates and just sort of munch on that 
like every night and I haven't done that um, basically yeah. since I started the challenge um, um, there's been a night like we've had an ice cream or something but not just sat there and just pigged out on like crap so um, I'm really proud for those changes and I can definitely notice a difference in like my skin and just how I'm feeling and stuff like that um, yeah so um, yeah lots of little improvements but yeah they're the things I'm noticing and that like I'm feeling so bad if I do go off the rails a little bit like I'm not even enjoying it like I just feel bad um, so yeah I think it's all positive change this week I have uh, like almost a whole week off work um, I'm not working till Friday and then that's the only day I'm working this week so um, I really feel like I have a really good opportunity to do some really good uh, workouts put some um, meal prep time in and just get prepared um, so that I'm not left stuck with nothing no other options to do but bad food so um, yeah um, I'm feeling good about this week I, I sort of yesterday I had a really terrible day um, um, girls will know but I'm really bloated um, so I've had a little visitor this month which is um, probably too much information for some guys out there watching but it's huge for me I um, have not had anything like that for like almost a year um, because of the polycystic ovarian syndrome um, so literally I've been doing the challenge for six weeks now and I have had two visitors um, in a row so that is like such a change in your body like so I'm more impressed with those changes than the scales um, so yeah yesterday I was like really bloaty we had a bad day with food and I just was like oh, I'm terrified of the weigh-in tomorrow like I just dreading um, putting on weight like I kind of didn't expect to lose anything even though I had been working out every day this week because my food kind of wasn't great so um, to know that yeah I lost a little bit is like awesome I'm so happy with that it shows that everything I'm doing is helping um, but mainly it's the attitude changes for me the the drive to do better and um, yeah, just even little things like we went out to dinner with James's family, which we do every week and you know They opened up some chips and chocolate and I didn't have anything I was the only one who just like didn't have any and yeah I'm just doing little things like that where I'm able to just control myself and no, it's not worth Not worth it at the moment. So um, yeah, is mommy doing good? Mm. Yes, is mm. mommy working out? Yes. Are we doing squats? Hi. Squats! Mm. Uh, Push-ups? Yeah, and sit-ups. Sit-ups. Yeah, you were helping. Mummy. Mummy and Noah. I. Yeah. Noah. Noah. You say fitness. <laughs> say go, mummy. Go, go, mummy. Go, mummy. So I hope everyone else has had a super awesome week. Um, and yeah, if there's anything I can do to help, feel free to shoot me a question in the comments section. Uh, thanks for all the love on the video, guys. I'm really, su um, really surprised by all the support. It's very encouraging. I think it's definitely making me stray stay on track. So um, thanks, guys, and I'll check in with you next week. Bye! Bye, <laughs> Bye guys! Bye.